OSS, one of the faceless, nameless army who fought the lonely war, the silent war, on the fighting fronts and behind enemy lines. Until now, stories untold of heroes unknown. This is a mission from the annals of the OSS, the Office of Strategic Services. OSS. seasick either. All right, Sergeant. Well, according to our reconnaissance, those boys are up against two infantry divisions, an artillery section, two panzer units, two big Bertha guns, and the Luftwaffe. It's gonna be a rough road to Rome. I'm not sure assignment. It helps smooth it out a little. Here's the problem. Procedure, names of partisan contacts, and your cover story. When will I leave? One week from tonight. Why the delay? Well, I know you speak Italian, but your accent's not so good. Well, I can't straighten that out in seven days, Chief. You won't have to. Yes, sir? Send in Mr. Cianelli. Your job will be to collect information on German replacements and forward it to the beachhead. If they know what's coming, they'll be able to deal with it. Right. Mr. Cianelli, I'd like you to meet Captain Frank Hawthorne. And I'm very happy to meet you, Captain. The oh, pleasure is mine. For the next week, you'll be working with Mr. Cianelli, night and day. At the end of that time, you'll have a cover story and you won't need an Italian accent. Well, I, uh, I don't get it. Perhaps I had better tell you. You see, Captain, I am a teacher of the Italian language at the London School for the Deaf and the Mute. Holy smokes. You mean I not only have to speak Italian, I have to talk with my hands, too? Why not, Captain? After all, we Italians, we always talk with the hands.